so I've deleted this video off YouTube and I'm re-uploading it now because my background music, I forgot to turn it down um, and you couldn't hear me and I didn't realise until people actually watched the video and told me so. Thank you to those who let me know because I wouldn't have noticed otherwise. Um, so yeah, enjoy my video. Hi! Mm. Welcome back to my channel. I am here today to do a haul of all the little things I got recently and also to just have a quick chat again um a few of you noticed that I disappeared for a while um, my channel was taken down I wasn't deleted I like deactivated my channel for a bit and I also deactivated my Instagram and um, both are back up now pardon me um, yeah, both are back up now. I just had some issues going on in my life and I wanted some time away and I didn't want to be up on the insert and stuff. So I took everything down. Um, and also when I reactivated my channel, my videos were still there but all my followers were gone. And I was very, very upset. But I was in contact with YouTube and they sorted it for me so I've got everyone back. Um, but the bad thing is, all my replies to comments on every single one of my videos is now gone. That happens when you deactivate your YouTube channel. So if you both watch an old video and I've ignored comments, I haven't, I promise. There was a reply to them once, but now all the replies are gone. So anyway, haul time. So I've had quite a few bits recently during my absence and I want to show you. So first I'll show you the toys. So I have the new Care Bears Unlock the Magic toy of Cheer Bear and she's super super cute she's really soft and cuddly and I love her. I got her on Amazon and she came with like a collector's coin thing. I think she was £15 including shipping. I think. But I really really love her and I really want all of them but it's so expensive. I love her lots. And then I also have this talking flop of Bing. Oh, a particularly ripe banana. I love him lots. I love him loads. Um, he was quite expensive. Well, I got him with a gift card, so it's okay. He was, I pre ordered him off Amazon, but he's available to buy now. And then also, you've met Dorothy and Honey before, they're best friends, and they sleep in my bed every single night. Well, I found Honey's little sister in the shop, and they're both the same bunny from the same place, but this is Diddy Honey, her little sister, and they're all very happy to be together. Okay, what's next? Next, this was off a family member. Quite a few of these off a family member now. This is like a bootleg Eeyore, like a fairground style one, or like a claw machine or something. I think it's an older one, I'm not sure. Maybe like early 2000s, 90s. I don't know. It looks like it. But this was off a family member, and I think he's really cute. And then the same family member gave me this little piglet. I have one similar, but I don't care. I love him. Um, and then the one who gave me those won me this Christopher Robin piglet from the arcade. So I was just looking at the tag, and he's really, really sweet. He's really soft and squishy and cuddly too. I wanted to win the whole set of them in the arcade because they had Eeyore, Tigger, Piglet and Pooh. They only had one poo though, and he was like buried at the bottom of all the teddies. And there was a lady trying to win him, but she obviously couldn't get him, and she spent lots of money and then gave up. A bit silly. Um, and then these three, um, these two I got them really, really cheap on eBay. I think I've mentioned before that I don't buy poo things unless they're stupidly cheap. I don't like paying lots of money for them. So I got this one for a pound. He is King Poo. He's got a little crown and a little crushed velvet outfit and his book says King Poo. 
and he's got his original tack. He's a early 2000s Disney store one. Uh, 2002. So yeah, I love him. And then I got this Puma's a squirrel. And I really love him. And the reason I got this one is because I used to have Daegu's. And if you don't know what they are, they're cousins of chinchillas. They're rodents. And they have faces like squirrels. Um, and my Daegu sadly passed away. This is a Daegu footprint here. Um, but yeah, I really, really missed them. And I always used to refer to them as my squirrels because no one knew what Daegu's are. So now I have a little squirrel pill to like remember them by. I know that's silly. And then my internet friend got me this pineapple boo. I've wanted him for ages and he's really expensive and hard to find. Um, but it's quite funny because my friend got me this and it arrived and I posted it online and then my mum um, turned out she bought me the same poo a few months ago and it was going to be a surprise. So I gave that one to a family member. Um, but yeah, I have pineapple poo with the tags. I don't know what year this is from. It must be 90s judging by the tag. But I love him. Okay, what's next? Next is a Barbie doll that I've wanted for ages. I always want things for ages, don't I? It's because I want a lot. <laughs> I'm only joking, I'm not that silly. But I have had my eye on this one since he came out. I've had loads of opportunities to buy him, but I never did, and I always regretted it after. But I've got Mermaid Ken, and he is beautiful. I love him. I got him with an Amazon gift card. And then... My friend sent me a pack of Toy Story colouring books. There was this one and a smaller one. And they're actually poos, but he let me colour Bo Peep. The mine. Poo. Oh. What's next? Next are two things I got from the charity shop. So first I got this copy of The Very Hungry Caterpillar because I had a bigger one but I gave it away and now I regretted it. So I bought another copy and this is like a board book one so I prefer it. And then they had like 30 different Dora books but I had to get the Christmas one because Christmas is my favourite time of year and I really really miss it. Um, and then the last few things my little friend who is local to me is moving house and they had to get rid of some little things so they gave some to me so I've got three storybooks and I've got two My Little Pony puzzles Rarity, my favourite um, and then this box has blocks of the alphabet on and it's like a washing machine tablet box so it smells really good Oh, there is one other thing. Um, this book, The True Meaning of Smack Day. It's the book that the movie Home was based on, and Home is one of my favourite movies ever. I've got loads of toys of him. And my friend in America is actually making me an adult dummy with, oh, the little purple guy on it. And I'm really excited! So, I think that's everything. Hmm, yeah, it is. So that is my haul. Let me know what your favourite thing was. My favourite thing is either flop or pineapple poo. Yeah. Because <laughs> I wanted them for ages. I can't remember if I said that I pre-ordered flop, but he's available on Amazon now. I can't remember. I have a new thing coming. It's if you watch Hey Doggy, you might know what it is. There's a stick and it dances and sings. It goes stick, 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 sticky, stick, stick. Well, I've got a teddy of the stick coming and it sings the song. And I'm really excited for it. But that doesn't come for like another week and a bit. And it's been pre-ordered since June. So yeah, that's my haul. I hope you liked it. I hope you liked my video and I will try to start posting more. I'm not gonna post as much as I used to for a little bit because I'm still taking like a sort of break um but yeah um I'm gonna be doing a updated colouring book collection video and a colour with me video if there's anything you want me to record feel free to message or comment and I will see what I can do so yeah thank you for watching and I'll see you very soon bye bye